The World Series of Bowling rolls on time now. The PBA Women's Series presented by Bowl.com. Here are your finalists for the Chameleon Championship. She is the 2006 Queens winner. Nine-time member of Team USA, four times on Junior Team USA from Phoenix, Arizona, Shannon Wulowski. Her opponent won the Women's Series Cheetah Championship in 2008. She owns 20 pro titles. Two-time Bowler of the Year from Keller, Texas, C.D.B. Carolyn Doran. Let's check in on the women's semifinal action here at the Chameleon Championship. On one side of the brackets, Carolyn Doran Ballard, CDB, and Jody Wester. They went to seven games, CDB winning at 246 to 218. In the other semifinal, it was Shannon Pluhowski, 4 2 over Liz Johnson. That sixth game, a tight one, Pluhowski taking it 256 to 248. Pluhowski will start us off on the left lane, the lefty from Phoenix, Arizona. What a great game she has, Rob. I, I just love watching her throw it. Just a smooth rhythm and tempo. Great arm swing, beautiful release, and a nice result. Carolyn Doran Ballard, 45-year-old mother of one from North Richland Hills, Texas. Wife of Hall of Famer Del Ballard. The Brooklyn strike. She'll take it, but certainly not what she wanted, Randy. Boy, that, that ball checked up pretty early, and uh, that's the last thing your opponent wants to see is have, have you cross over and go Brooklyn. Watch this. It never gets far enough right, and then all of a sudden it looks like somebody kicks it left, and that's flush Brooklyn. Now let's see if she can capitalize on it on this left lane and get one in the 1-3 for a double. still left of where she wants to be. And Rob, we've already sp talked about how tough this oil pattern is. The middle part of the lane is very dry. If you miss target to the inside, there's no way the ball's going to hold its line. The Ballard had the messenger take down the 10 pin in the first frame. No luck here in the second, trying to clean it up with a spare. Just saw her spare percentage this week. <laughs> Ah, you love the face <laughs> from CDB. She lets you know where she stands at all times, doesn't she, with her facial expressions. We take a look at the tail of the tape between our two finalists, CDB and Shannon Pluhowski. Well, we already know how tough the right side of the lane is. Shannon Pluhowski, our, our only southpaw, if she has a good look on her side, could spell big trouble for Carolyn Dorn Ballard. Back-to-back -back jacks for Shannon P. Shannon using two different bowling balls and looks lined up early on. Carolyn Dorn Ballard, uh, not, not so, so much. much. That's called flush in the biz, Rob, just so you know. I like your terminology. Kuhowski lost in the season opening Women's World Championships to Kelly Kulik, 219-204. for three. And nothing like tripping the 6, 7, 10 late for a three-bagger. Watch this. This ball's going to drift just a pinch high. She's like, all right, no, no split. No, no, okay. Wow. It's like finding money on the street. Or in your back pocket. I've always loved that. Ooh, where'd that 20 come from? CDB in the third, working off a spare. But she has still not found the pocket yet. Well, she went to another ball, and, and it actually tried to push a little bit farther right. But the last three shots, all of them way too heavy on the head pin. Carolyn likes to go down and in. She's a down and in player. And, and so the move for her would be to somehow try to take her hand out of it, move a little bit right, and get that ball 
to just go a little bit straighter down the lane. I don't see her moving in and opening the lane up. And I want to remind you, coming up here after the women's championship, the men's title match, Bill O'Neill, the real deal, looking for title number one, taking on Ronnie Russell. Back-to-back -back spares for CDV. Last year for her, another great year. She says, anytime you win, it's going to be a good year. Bold wealth, the U.S. Open, the Queens, the mixed doubles. Three career majors for CDB. Second at this year's U.S. Open. Still has not won that title. That could have been a 7-10 split. Instead, she drops all 10. Yeah, that could have been five. I mean, she's got two strikes in four frames, and she's very, very lucky to have that. One Brooklyn, one nosediver. Take a look at this. This cuts right through the heart, and that's just a huge break. It has not been pretty, but it's been fairly effective. CDB not bowling a strong game, but she is still in it through three and a half.